there as well. Plays it along the boards to Landmesser right point. Takes the shot, scores! River Kings power play goal. Derek Landmesser, a seeing eye that goes through everything and goes in past Runestead for the goal. 55 seconds into the first period of play. Landmesser makes it a 1-0 lead for the River Kings. Power play goal here in the first Yolito. period. Yolito in across the line. Big shot turned away. Rebound scores. Kins gets the rebound, ties it up at 1-1 at the 2-0-3 mark here in the first period. Beach made the first save, allowed a rebound, and Hens puts it in to knot it up at 1-1. And where River King's postgame fun takes place after every home game. There's a shot and a goal! And... Uh, that came from out front just as we were coming back to action. 13.57, time of the goal. It's either Joe Marcuson or Dean for a 2-1 lead. Centering play by Dumont. Shot goes wide by Gascon. Another centering play blocked up the crease. Now here's Landmesser with a try. There's a save. Another try. They are just peppering Grunestedge. And finally, Looking the center. Met there by Bauman. Nelson carries on. Up front, shot, save. Oh, what a great set up there for Garrett Larson by Jeff Nelson. And Grunestedge had to come center up. ice. And they have a two-on-one here coming in to the right side. A shot and a rebound goal. Len Messer took the opening shot, and he may get credit for the goal as the shot apparently was stopped by Grunestedge early on but then somehow got past him into the net. Now over to Summers. Summers clears it across the line. Controlled by the River Kings. A chance here, two on one. Nelson feeds out front, shot, score! Jeff Erkenbrack with the feed from Jeff Nelson and beats the Greenest Edge. It's four to one, River Kings. 11.52, time of the goal, and Jeff Alcombrack scores the third straight goal for the River Kings. Blazers across the line. Shot save, Beach. Rebound scored. Yolito able to poke it in. Beach was trying to get over to cover the puck, but couldn't get there fast enough. And Yolito was able to put it in. That will get the Blazers within two. Time of the goal will be at 16-23. D.J. Yolito, who has been hot for this to team. Ted Vandermeer, stopped there. Now they get it back to Bill. Out front for Flex. Shot score. Might have been a deflection. And the Blazers get back within one on a power play goal. As Marshall back on the ice. Power play goal by Oklahoma City comes at the 17-20 mark. Here in the second period. Here they come in again. And the puck is stopped at the crease by Beach. Cleared over to the near side. Bauman shoots it in. That's blocked. And Pres Bjorka shot blocked. The backhander and a score. 17-48. And Ted Vandermeer has tied the game. And the Oklahoma City fans are very excited. As they have scored the center ice. Shot off Hens, controlled by Dumont. Now over to Gascon, moving in, pass for Larson. Shot blocked by Grunestedge. Pinks off coming up in the Oklahoma City zone. A minute 47 remaining here in the second period of play left wing side across the line gets past Bauman into the corner plays it back behind the net over to the near corner and a big hit there knocking down Jeff Nelson Patterson laying out Jeff Nelson now Stoddard and Patterson going after it and the linesman have to break that up Nelson was blindsided there by Patterson the arena here has been silenced Nelson still on his back in the corner.
They're attending there to by Samos, retaken there by the Blazers. Puck covered by Beach. And a couple of players tie up in the crease area once again. Yolito, one of them. And uh, he wants a piece. I like to see Presbiorca go into the offensive zone. Bump there, they're shorthanded. Looks to center, but it's blocked away at the last moment. By Beach and the Blazers River Kings. Clear it coming. back out to center. Stopped there by the River Kings. Flipped ahead of the Oklahoma City line. Dumont now taking a hit is on the ice. And play whistle down. And Rick Handlin is back out there taking a look at Louis Dumont. The River Kings have really taken a battering here. Two minute mark here in overtime. Puck taken away by Larson. Larson is tripped up. Penalty coming up. This is a one minute call in overtime, but Larson is shaken up now. Boy, if the River Kings come out of here with a win tonight, it's going to come at a big time cost. As Gascon, going in the right box. side, moving in, drops it back to Landmesser. Back over to Gascon. Gascon, Summer scores! Overtime goal, River Kings win! Landmesser to Gascon to Summers, and Summers beats Grunestedge at the 338 mark. Overtime victory for the River Kings, 5 to 4. 338 will be the time of the goal, and Matt Summers is the hero tonight as a battered River Kings team wins this one after seeing three players go down and leave the rink. Martinson, I see him walk into the locker room. He's going to be okay. But wow, what a battle tonight. Both teams fought hard. River Kings win in overtime. Five to four. The final score is Matt Summers is the goal scorer that gets the game winner tonight. Post game show follows coming.